college. I, you could be sued for calling the school a BOC college. <laughs> it was four years. I didn't have to take a single math class all those four years. That's why I chose it. <laughs> oh, I got a spy report that's going to fucking blow you guys. Yep, I got to turn off my radio. Stream elements. Tim the blacksmith is now live. Great. <coughs> I am now live. Better than ever. All right, so. Camera's all foggy again. Getting set up here. We'll fire up the forge here in a second. Stream elements. Space punch just subscribed for four oh. months in a row. Space to punch you. Oh. <laughs> So like I'm in this nice sexy mist. Thank you for the sub, my friend. Stream elements. Fatal one oh one two just subscribed for three months in a row. Man, we got Gandalf popped up early. Thank you for the subscription. Once we get our forge fired up, this this cool dude haze will. Uh, We'll go away, hopefully. Welcome to the forge. Let's see if we can uh, make a candle holder, eh? Ginger underscore snap. Man, fuck you guys. My prime isn't available for another 40 minutes. Stream elements. Let's hear dirty limerick number 98. That's all right. We'll start off with a dirty limerick. Starting off dirty. Let's see if we can get a good one, huh? In our uh, pot smoker haze here. Whoa, man. Like, whoa. I gotta work on my camera angles too. You guys get a little dirty dirt in the back there. 
Uh, we're starting off dirty with number 98 compliments. Let's mute the music. <laughs> dirty Limerick, number 98 compliments of a ginger snap. All right, let's see how my reading skills are today. There was a young man of Seattle who bested a bull. It, right? I got to turn off uh, his text to speech while I'm doing this, too. Uh, all right, here we go. Hold on, I got distracted. We'll start, we'll start from the beginning. There was a young man from Seattle who bested a bull in a battle with fire and with gumption. He assumed the bull's function and deflowered the whole herd of cattle. Ha, huh, I like that. Yeah, it's a little distracting. All right, let me say that again. Really fast. So you guys have time. There was a young man of Seattle who bested a bull in a battle with fire and with gumption. He assumed the bull's function and deflowered the whole herd of cattle. Bars. I'm like T-Pain. I think I guess it's a good, uh, Jeesh. <laughs> For the way you typed that and the way he said it, it was not as in, uh, impactful. Jeesh. That's a lot of cow. Oh, that's kind of cool. You get a number two with a gift sub. That's kind of cool looking emblem. I did. Are you guys able to choose? So I made a couple like uh, arm colors that you can put as one of your badges when you subscribe. Is that like an option for you? There should be like a green one, a red one, an orange one for different months. Uh, so maybe the first is just the best. Well, the first is the best. All right, so that was a good one. I like that one. Is it down like on uh, on your cog wheel next to your chat? Is there like a chat icon or something or change my badge or something? I don't know. Cause so, I don't know, whatever. The first one's still cooler anyways. Thanks for the subs, my friends. Um, I didn't bring anything to keep my hair out of my face today, so this will be fun. Okay. I might be able to do some work with how a coat is in the 40s, so that's kind of, uh, kind of warming up. Jim the Blacksmith! Ginger underscore snap. Why is it so hazy? Uh, my camera fogs up. Um, so once I get it warm, it should uh, defog it, in theory. I guess somehow moisture or something gets Ginger in there. Ginger underscore I don't know. snap. I see. Sometimes if I wipe it vigorously and warm it up a bit, it. Uh, fixes it. I guess I gotta invest into... Oh, <coughs> SOS, <laughs> locate DJM. That's what he says. Damn it. Wipe it vigorously. I think I'm gonna have to invest in some uh, low temperature cameras. That's getting a little better. But yeah, I just gotta get it heated up.
Give all bit shine, bit shine. There we go. That's a little better, huh? All right. Bit shine. So, actually, let me show you a picture of what we are going to try and make today. Um, actually, I have a picture on my phone. Let me just do that. It'll be easier. So I got this idea from a cool uh, tavern place in Gettysburg that we go for dinner um, sometimes. Um, so that's kind of the idea we're, we're going for. If I can get a, not a bad reflection. So the piece I got on my anvil now, we'll try and twirl that up and then um, we'll try and make some sort of cup thing to put it into. Uh, and then it's got that little, uh, little thing up there to hold it. Um, so yeah, it's like an Ebenezer Scrooge old-timey candle holder thing. Uh, so we'll uh, we'll see if we can make that today. Ginger underscore snap. Dope. Well, the idea is dope. We'll see if we can execute, visualize, and execute. I need to take some time and get rid of some of my dust that's all on the in my pot and on my top of my forge. Get rid of some of this coal dust, all these clinkers. And this hair is really out of this is just out of control. I still gotta make that uh, put your hair back up uh, redemption. Because maybe some people will be nice to me. I doubt it. Ginger underscore snap. Doubtful. Yeah, very doubtful. Now I'm all blurry. I'm all blurry. Focus on me. No. Focus. Space punched. Highly unlikely. You're right. The internet is not full of nice people that want to do nice things to me. They just want to make me look like a fool. Focus on my beautiful face. Hello. There you go. Oh, stay with me. Oh, oh, stay with me. Still in focus. Yeah. Focus. You can do a little song and dance. Hello, my lady. Hello, my darling. Hello, my right All right, so instead of a dancing stick, we're going to make it into a candlestick holder. Let's light up the forge. Don't run out of newspaper. I got this packing paper, which is not as good, but... Hopefully, it'll be okay. Jesus, Jesus, I can't see. I freaking light my hair on fire. Still works, that's good. Uh, let's get a little fresh stuff in there. I don't know how people deal with their hair being down all day. This is just not comfortable. It's not even it's not economical, it's not ergonomical. I feel like it's bright in here. That's a little better. Where's 
my fire stick. Where is the lighter? You were lights better than that. Flame resistant paper. Ginger underscore snap. Is your pot of water frozen today? Uh sure is. Oh, you can't see that. Oh yeah, a little bit. We'll have to cook up some more blacksmith stew here. Suck tube. Suck harder, suck tube. It's a little smoky. But we's in business. There we go. The old suck tube sucking away now. Oh, <coughs> SOS. Locate DJL. He says, damn it. The old suck tube. Like we know what we're doing, huh? Woo! All right, so let's see what I want to try and do first here. Um, maybe we'll try and do the twirls first, and then see how high we want to get it. And then we'll uh, we'll do the hand holder part. That seems like an idea. Um, well, actually, first we gotta heat this up, and uh, it's a little rusty and kind of pitted, so we're just gonna heat it up and um, stop throwing sparks. Uh, just clean up the metal a little bit, at least for now. My camera's not foggy, it's just really smoky in here. Such is life. Okay. Oh, actually, I think I forgot to reset my counter. Flash, edit, counter, drop. Stream elements. At Tim the blacksmith changed the drops counter from one to zero. Stream elements. At Tim the blacksmith changed the owies counter from zero to zero. I didn't have any owies last time. Wow! I must be getting good at this. Stream elements. 
Hollywood underscore PWNSS just subscribed for four months. Hollywood Poneses. Thank you, sir. Four months in a row. Joins the club. With all the cool kids. Yeah, it's a little smoky. It started a little, uh, this old suck tube wasn't sucking as good as it should have been to begin with. Let me crack a window here. That's what he said, right, guys, because it's gay? Smoke never killed anyone, right? Hey, right, what is going on here? Hey, Ginger under space now. Well, well, indeed. Hollywood underscore PWNSS. No, no such thing as smoke inhalation. I didn't think so. Open the garage door. Maybe it'll, yeah, it's a little pokey on the end. <sighs> well, I guess nothing too exciting Ginger at this point. Just kind of heating it up and uh, scraping it out just to kind of clean it up before we bend it around. Uh, I got this pipe that I think will bend it around, and I got a candle here to kind of eye it up. Ginger but I think this will give us. It's totally fine. I think this will give us the uh, the width we want. I ain't else all the time. It's totally fine. Exactly. Gotta turn up my volume a little bit. It's uh, 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 uh. a good tune. That's what she said. Suppose I could always change to my anvil camera at some point, huh? Ginger underscore snap. Oh, that's loud. This is a good tune. Song ends three seconds later. <laughs> right? Let's continue on down the line. Oh yeah, we got a nice cold forge today. She's looking good. And so am I. Ooh. <laughs> Still a little smoky in here.
It's okay, it's like I'm in a rave. Hollywood underscore PWNSS. Need some laser lights. Right? Actually, you know what? Oh, wait for it. You ready for this? It's about to go down. Um, running out of places to plug things in. Uh, maybe this one? No. Hollywood underscore PWNSS. Epilepsy warning. Epilepsy warning! Oh, it's like you know what I was going for. Oh, oh, strobe lights. All right, hold on. Wait for this. Let's see if this, how this looks. Okay. This is totally safe to blacksmith in a strobe light, right? How does it look on the anvil? All right, we're just having a party now. It's not giving enough light for the anvil here. Hold on, hold on. Mm -hmm. Okay, hold on. We're getting our lighting situated, folks. It needs to be darker. What's up? Welcome to the forge, yo. Let's go. Those are my killer dance moves here in Tim's party barn. Got some of my, uh, pause. Time out. Time out. Got some of my. I underscore PWNSS. I am deceased. Thank you. You're welcome. From my epic dance moves. Well, at least I got your subscription before you died, so all's well.
Come on, mouse. Why are you not working right now? Uh, 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 uh. Lone Mountain Knife Coat. Do you mind being a meme? <laughs> uh, I guess not. Do you, do you know how to, can you make a, are you making a meme out of me? Look at this, intense rave blacksmithing. Strobe light right in the eyes as I do this is not distracting at all. Uh, we're getting close to starting to get enough of this cleaned up, I think. Maybe a couple more goes. Welcome to the four. Oh boy. What is this? What is this, Cliff? Is it epic? <laughs> Heck yeah, there we go. Party. That's the moves right there. Oh yeah. <laughs> Perfect. Good clip. High quality programming right here. And pro dance moves. I'm liking it being darker in here though. I can see the what color my my metal should be. I'm gonna cut the background out and do something with you dancing. Heck yeah, go for it. You gotta spread these sweet dance moves worldwide. Oh yeah. Uh, the sun is setting over here. So we're gonna get some extra light here, but then it's gonna go down, and then we're gonna bring it back up over here. Uh, 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 uh. And then it's smithing after dark. OP1, welcome to the stream, my friend. Uh, we are making a uh, candle holder. I can show you the idea here in a second after this heat. Um, right now we're uh, having a little bit of a rave. Stream elements. And uh, thank you for following OP Wan. Hey, thank you for the follow, my friend. Um, so right now we're just cleaning up our shaft a little bit, uh, and then we're going to uh, twirl it around. Um, but yeah, I'll show you here in a second. And I think that's going to be enough. I think that'll be good enough for uh, cleaning it up for the time being. So, uh, I'm going to start at the bottom and then we'll start twisting this up. Yeah, work that shaft. Oh, I am. You know how I roll. Oh, I look kind of spooky. Whoa, spooky Tim the Blacksmith. 
We're uh, we're going for this idea there. Uh, That's what she said. That's what she said. That's what she said. <laughs> Just gonna work in the shaft. Focus. Uh, that's the idea we're going for today, OP1. Uh, so we're going to start with a twirly bit on the bottom and uh, work our way up. Um, so I have a pole here that I'm going to try and wrap it around. And uh, yeah, let's get her heated up. Um, might need some gloves. It's gonna be a little hot. Poles and shafts and poles and shafts and poles and shafts. The life of a blacksmith is full of poles and shafts and working it. So I'm gonna start this curve a little from the bottom because I want a little nub that we'll put through our bottom piece and then we'll peen over uh, to make, uh, well, we gotta make the cup thing too, the wax catcher, if you will. Um, so we're gonna start this wrap a little higher than the bottom. Which is uh, just my best guess on how to do this. So we'll see how it works. Uh, probably some pliers. Hold on, don't walk away from your metal, Tim, for too long. Uh, where are... Steal the Ospi cat. Oh my goodness. It's a wild tip. Stelios! Yeah, you better get your master ball out for this one. We're having a rave! Stelios the cat. Hi all. Space punch. Sue at Steely Ost B Cat. Yeah, I think this will be an okay start. It might be a little big, but um So we just we just twisted it real quick. Uh, we're just gonna keep doing that up and up, essentially. The idea. Steely Ostica. So is this a candle holder with a handle? Yes, that is exactly what it is. It's also a rave party. Steely Ost the Cat. Oh. That's not gonna stay there. Hold on, don't burn your metal, Tim. Yeah, we're gonna loop it around like a, a candle or a circular shape to put the candle in. Steely Ostby Cat. How come a rave party? Why not a rave party, bruh? What do you mean?
Steely Ost Beacon. Be dancer ever. Ah, my wall's getting in the way. I can't spin it far enough. Wonder if I should do this horizontally instead of up in the air like this. <sighs> oh, get out of here now! Ow, a little warm. Steely Ost Beacon. Best. Best. That's right. So we got another loop in there. It's looking pretty good, I think. Um, I think I'm going to resituation my pole here to go horizontally. Might be easier. Okay, I keep hitting my wall because my uh, my shaft is so long. So maybe we go this way. I think I need to get a third camera for my, my vice camera at some point, you know? Don't burn your metal, Tim. Give me such an issue here. There we go. So now, you know, I can't see a damn thing with this all this hair in my face. Oh, Jesus, whose idea was this? Okay. Now, let's see if going horizontally works better. Give me a bat. Give me a bat. Here we go. So, we got uh, a couple of twists in there. So, we're just working our, our way up, keeping a little bit of gaps in there. Um, and then at the end, we're going to, we'll take this bottom and then just like 90 degree it down so then we can ping it, peen it into the, uh, the base. But, Shaping up to how we want to. Oh. Don't want to melt my candle, so let's not do that again. Smells nice though. All right, I think I've had enough of the strobe light for now. We'll uh, finish the dance party another time. My eyes hurt. Oh, wow. Ugh. Ugh. It's like at the end of a bar and they turn all the lights on and you're like, Man, I've been talking to you all night. Ugh. I'm going to go home alone. Good, good. I'm glad you enjoyed it, Stelios. Hollywood underscore PWNSS. Yes, sure, and back off. There is a scary man there. <laughs> yeah, tell me about it.
Hey, it was fun dancing with you. Where are you going after this? Can we get some coffee or, you know, maybe some pizza and some sex? What, you don't like pizza? All right. We'll have to mount the uh, strobe lights somewhere for a better dance party at another time. Hollywood underscore PWNSS. Turn the strobe into a point redemption. Yeah, that's a good idea. Strobe party for a while. I gotta work on my lighting anyways. So maybe that'll be part of my my lighting. Hey, fixing up stuff here. Yeah, this is working out pretty good. Got another another curl in there. Man, I hope I have enough steel for this. I don't know how many turns I can get in here. A couple of them are kind of close together, but that's okay. They'll be a little different each way. It's all right. We're getting there. Karate in the barn. I'm also Kung Fu Master. So watch out. You'll get the business. If I can see you anyways. I really need to cut this stuff off, you know? This is just, this is out of control. Oh yeah, the hair down is about first five minutes that I go live. It's just, it's inevitable. Everyone just thinks I look way too sexy with my hair down. They just, they can't, they're like, why you got it up? Space punched. Yes, ma'am. There we go. I'm also learning how to make springs, I guess. This is fun. Cool. This is actually turning out to be a little more easier than I thought, which is always a good thing. Either I'm learning or I just got lucky. There we go. Now we're on number four little springy look so I guess they'll at least get a couple few more twirls out of it I want it to be kind of I want it to be bigger than that or longer than that but I might uh, might run out of material before I get the full height that I was aiming for but that's okay Uh, 
Um... And then we'll have to figure out how we're going to make the bottom cup part. I have... I have this piece of random bit that I got that was just laying around somewhere. Um, it's kind of flimsy, but I think I might be able to pound, like, maybe I'll cut a circle out and then pound it to make a little cup out of it. Or I could just leave the springs on it. That'd be kind of cool. Well, I think that's a little too big for what we're going for here, but... We will find out. Stay tuned. Epic conclusion coming up. some of this scale and I'll probably I'll keep up on it but once we get to the end we'll warm it all up and then give it a good scrape anyways but we'll keep chugging along Well, you know what? I'm getting thirsty, so I'm going to go ahead and redeem some of my own Timbits here. Uh, I'm going to buy myself a beer. Beer is good. 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 here guys and forget our metal hold on bros I can't see oh no oh no every time you guys well sparkly it's gonna have some character friends it's gonna have some character where's my thing come on Hollywood underscore PWNSS. Way to go, Fatal. You gave him a sparkler, you jerk. What a jerk. Making me chug beers and sparkling. Phew! Not a head, not a breath headbanging here, apparently. Apparently, it takes a lot of energy to headbang and you get a sparkler. Apparently, you shouldn't get a beer and leave your blower on. You burn up your metal. See, this is something those propane forges, forge users don't have to worry about. They can just set their metal in the fire and walk away for an hour and it's not gonna burn up. Not so much over here, friends. Okay. Miss Nolte! Yeah, yeah. Hope you won. How much shorter did your project get? <laughs> well, luckily we're good. It didn't get uh, it didn't get shorter, it's just a little bit bubbly on one part of it. Um where'd my bottle opener go? 
We'll use our fun bottle opener that we made uh, last stream or a stream ago. Oh, works like a charm. Get yours today, timdeblacksmith.com. Just kidding, I don't have supplies to sell yet. But in the future, soon. Um, so, as we take a small drink break here, we'll show you what we're at. So it's coming together pretty good. Some coal stuck to it. Get out of there. So that's where we're at. Really gotta move my, my lighting so you can see a little bit better, but um, there's just a little bit of charred bits on the inside. I mean, the outside was always rough because of a piece of metal that I have. Um, but it's a little, it's got some character to it. It's got some character to it. So, if we compare this to what we're looking at here. So, I mean, really, once I get, yeah, I guess I gotta, I could have put these a lot uh, farther apart, but we can always heat everything up and just kind of pull on it a little bit, and I think it'll, it'll be okay, and our candle will still fit in there. I mean, or it's just gonna be kind of a short, dumpy one, which isn't a bad thing either. It doesn't have to look exactly like this, but it's just the idea. Um, so. And this is now, that's right, the old timey. So, without trying to entirely melt this Ginger candle. Underscore snap. It's not about the size of the candle if you know what I mean. <laughs> so, I mean, right there, it's about, I mean, this is kind of a shorter candle, so it's actually not a bad size for this one. So it's about half the candle size. Hollywood underscore PWNSS. That's not what she said. <laughs> so, I'm trying to eye it up to see if I have enough room for one more twist. I think I do. I don't want, cause I still need enough to do like it a little up bit for your, for a finger hold. And the finger hold doesn't have to be that big, I suppose. I mean, this one has, so, so that one kind of has like a, a, a finger hold and then like that, like the long bit going Which down one? would go into your hand. So you, you, dude. So woo woo dude. What's up, Peach Wayne? Sue. We're trying to make this idea today. We're currently at this point. So, kind of similar, yes. Um, so I think if I do one more, uh, if I do one more twist, the handle is not gonna be as exuberant as this one in the picture. Like, it's not gonna be that long, which I'm not, I don't think I'm that worried about it. And I could probably, it could probably even just be, maybe I'll just do like a swirl at the top. So it's just like a finger hold and not, not like a long. All right, let's, uh, sorry, Fatal, I'm trying to chug, but I'm not a very good chugger. Fatal Redeemed uh, bought me a beer there right after I bought myself one because he's such a nice guy. 
That's okay. That's what it's there for. Forge back up the speed here. And we'll keep wrapping her up. So it's a little warmer out here so like in the 40s so I don't have to wear a jacket or a hat <clears throat> my mic seems to work better in the uh, not being so cold so Mike isn't uh, laying down on the job today so that's good We had a nice rave earlier, so that was fun. <clears throat> ah, delicious. About up to temperature. I think that's going to be good. It's getting a little warm. Give me a bat. Give me a bat. Come here. All right. I guess we're doing it this way. Oop, that's a little hot. Good thing I got gloves on. Stream elements. Ginger underscore snap just subscribed. Ginger! Yeah, Craig is the daddy. <laughs> Ginger, thank you for that subscription. Always good to see you, and good to see Gandalf popping his head in. Let's get a little warm. Get a little warm. All right. All right. This little guy is compliments of Fatal. Thanks, Fatal. I haven't tried this one yet, and we're about to. Kansas City, Missouri, Boulevard Brewing, Irish Ale, traditional red ale. The other one was Killian's, which is always a good one. Oh, this bottle opener is legit. Let me tell you what. Top of the morning to you, Fatal. Tasty. Um, all right, so. Uh, let's get this whole thing. So here's where we're at now. Fatal 101 ST. Smithwick's is my favorite Irish red ale. Yeah, Smithwick's is also delicious. So, so that's where we're at. So that's going to give us um, a little, little bit to work with here for the handle. 
which I think is good. I think that'll be good enough. Uh, I'm gonna heat up the, the springy part that we just made. Um, and I also gotta take this down to like a 90 degree angle to point straight down so we can paint, uh, paint it into the, the base. Um, so again, that's, uh, tis the season for some Irish Reds. That's right, Mrs. Smith. Um, cause I think that's the best way to attach it to the base is to just, uh, have a hole in the base and then pin it to the bottom of it. Um, so, so this kind of goes up and uh, so let's get the bottom a little more polished up get that 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 bottom piece cut down to like a 90 degree stream element we'll give it a good scrape xx people or xxx just subscribe vapor hey vapor's here thank you abraham Lots of long time subscribers here. Much appreciated. Thanks for hanging out. XX Maple or XXX. No more damn I'm good. That is for gifted subs. XX Maple or XXX. AHH okay. Peach wine. Although. I've got to turn off auto sub. Always miss out on the cool sounds. Yeah, man. I didn't even know Tinder there was. Underscore snap. Sub goal met. Sub goal met. What? Sub goal met 25? 25 already? Oh my goodness. You guys, this is awesome. Also, I didn't know there was an auto subscribe button. Where is that? So I can tell my uh, my my in-laws. At Peach Wine, you can just refresh the chat and the pop-up will show for your alerts. Although, I do like seeing that the Duke Nukem a lot more. I might have to switch it instead of Gandalf, but then again, maybe not. Because that's just, just a special day when people start gifting. But damn, we're at 25 submarines, huh? Thank you so much, guys. Um, Space punched. You can still broadcast your automatic sub unless you perma muted that noto at Peach Wine. XX Vapo or XXX. At Peach Wine, I mean after your sub renews. Um, what can we do to celebrate? We got our subs. Space I did punched. not expect that. Huh. I did not expect that. Space um, what he said. <laughs> uh, XX Vapo or XXX. Let's see a funnel for old times' sake. Yeah. <laughs> no, thank you. Stream elements. Peach hey! Subscribe for four months in a row. Gandalf is showing up quite a bit today. Love it. Thank you, Peach Wine, as always. Peach Wine. Oh, you can just click that button now. Ha ha. Oh, I'm closing it up a little bit. Actually, you know what? This is kind of um I'm kind of just separating it a little bit uh so I want some gaps XX in there. Or XXX. don't touch that yeah it's a, ah! it's a little warm that was kind of a half of a drop uh save up my anvil Stream elements 
Ugh. Tim has dropped something one times today. There we go. Bringing him to 63 lifetime drops, folks. Jeez, 63? I haven't even been doing it this long. Oh, that's cool. This is just like coming apart perfectly. Got a little... Um, oh, almost dropped that onto my hand, which would not have been good. Um, no, no, no. Um, where's my hammer? XX Vapor or XXX. I'm late. Did you make all the coils in that? Yeah, I just, yeah, I just made all these coils. Um, it was just getting a little bit cockeyed. I just don't want it to get too out of bed out of shape so that the, uh, the candle doesn't fit in there. Okay, we're still good. Um, so, all right, let's heat it up again. Man, we even, we're over our sub goal. This is awesome. We're gonna have to do a knife throwing competition on the house here, and uh, maybe give out some uh, some free tim bits here. Um, so I'm gonna heat this all up. Uh, but yeah, we coiled that around uh, this this bar here. Um, so I guess I'm pretty much done with this. And uh XX Vapor or XXX. Nice. So I'm gonna get this heated up. I kinda just wanna give it a good scrape off. I wanna get it cleaned up a little bit. Um and then what I was just running into right there is I wanted to put that 90 degree bend into the bottom. But since the whole coil was hot, I started pushing everything together, which I don't wanna do. So I'm gonna get it hot, I'm gonna scrape it off, um, and then I'm going to cool down the whole bit of a coil. So Let's hear your number 23. Sing me another verse, or send the other verse, follow me around by my willy. Um, so, and then I'm going to uh, cool down the spring and just heat up the end so I don't smash it all together while I'm trying to bend it over there. The Diamond House is going to be replacing all their fake candle holders for yours. That's right. All right, we'll do a dirty limerick here after this heat there, Vapor. We had a pretty good one earlier. Compliment of Ginger Snapper. Um XX Vapo or XXX. Mass fire today. Yeah, I just piled so I just piled a bunch of coal on top of my my whole piece. So yeah, we got a good uh we got a good fire going today. So after this one, I'm going to scrape it up and then I'm going to dunk it in the water just to cool down the rest of the springs and then fix up the bottom part. And then, uh, and then we'll flip it around. We'll uh, make a small taper down to a point for the it's other end and then work on the, the handle thing. I guess you could do that when it's cold, LOL. Yeah, well luckily it's not too cold today, which is good. But. Oh boy, no, we got a little sparkly. Yikes, that's not what we want. She's got more character, Johns. She's a little bubbly. Had enough of the snow yet, they're saying maybe another storm this weekend. Yeah, probably. Kind of straighten 
tighten that up a little bit. Um, give her a little bath here. XX people are XXX. But I can't complain, we're heading to Florida on Wednesday to visit the popsicle. Nice. Yeah, you gave me the lowdown on that. Sounds fun. All right, so. Get that dubstep. She's definitely gonna have some character to her, that's for sure. I did not think I was gonna get that that sparkly in there. It wasn't in that that, that long, but that's okay. It might actually kind of bode well with you know being a candle and like melted wax, like the holder itself is uh Boots and pants, boots and pants, boots and pants, boots and pants. Um, but it might actually work out okay. So give us some more texture, I guess. Um, man, this thing is... <laughs> it's kind of charred and nasty, but it's kind of cool, though. Um, so now I really just want to heat up the end of it there so I can bend that piece down without bending the entire spring. And then we'll work on the other end. But I guess the trick is getting just that one little piece in there. I guess in theory, I probably should have made that 90 degree angle before I started twisting everything, but here we are. We'll figure it out. <sighs> Sparkler ad, right? I should, that should be another one. I think I'd be pretty high with the sparklers. Anyone know a good barber? <laughs> ooh, 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 but then I could have epic headbangs with sweet XXX. fucking dance moves. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. My bad. You caught me in the middle of the heat and I, uh, I forgot about it. All right, hold on. Actually, our tip is pretty good there. We might be able to get this done. XX Vapo or XXX. Don't burden your metal alert noise. I'm just trying to manhandle it at this point. We're close. We'll, uh, don't you joke about cutting the hair. <laughs> okay, Mrs. Smith. Um, so one more heat after this limerick and we'll get that pointed straight down and we'll be good for that side of it. Um, man, I did get this thing a little crispy. <laughs> That's all right though. It's kind of cool though. All right. Uh, Dairy Limerick number 23. Here we go. Got her handy dandy notebook and her pen. Dairy Limericks. Let's uh, cut the sweet dance tunes so we can get the full 
XX Vapo RXX. Well, it. Uh, Bro stick is okay, and you didn't brush it yet. Right. Exactly. But the uh, the bit of sparkler that I did, there's not really much uh, brushing can do to <laughs> fix that. But it's okay because it's gonna add to the character. XX Vapo RXX. Uh, wait, what did I? What number did I say? Let me see here. Number twenty-three. Okay. Limerick number twenty-three. <sighs> Brought to you by XX Vapor XXX, supporter of the stream. XX Vapor or XXX with the cam. Yeah, you got the good dumper cam. That's all it's. We give it all here in Tim's party barn. I tell you what, we got it all. All right, let's see if uh, let's see how we go here. All right, shh, shh, quiet, quiet on the set, quiet on the set. A crooner who lived in West Shore caught both of his balls in a door. Now his mezzo soprano is rather piano, though he was a loud basso before. I feel like we've heard that one before. He was a loud basso, baso. I guess it'd be baso. Thank you for following flying underscore v underscore s underscore farm. Hey, flying vss farm. Thank you for the follow. That was kind of good though. I think they've. It's all right. Well, all right. One more time. We'll settle in. Okay. A crooner who lived in West Shore. Caught both of his balls in a door. Now his mezzo soprano is rather piano, though he was a loud basso before. That's okay. I'm gonna write okay on that one. I don't like the word basso. Like it says loud, a loud basso. Basso? I just don't like that word in there. I mean, I get it, but. Basso. Yeah, Medicare is as well. All right, we're gonna write this as Medicare. M E H D I O C R E. This one, Medicare. Hey, they're not all winners, but there are some good ones in there. Okay. You need to have some of the bad so you can enjoy the good, you know? Yin and yang. All right. What are we doing? Let's heat this thing back up. I got to get your tunes back going here. I can hear them, but you can't. We're getting kind of zen now. Don't burn your metal, Tim. All right, you guys can't let me get all zen like that. I go into another realm. This is your fault, guys. XX Vapor or XXX. Vapor's here. Need like an annoying alarm clock noise for us to use LOL. Fatal 101 ST. Starts forging katanas under a waterfall LOL. <laughs> That's what it feels like, right? And may have just given me a good crotch shot there. Sorry about that. XX Vapo or XXX. <sighs> oh wow, she is toasty F. <sighs> Told ya. Oh god. Um. Come on. 
gonna hold on to it right, Tim. No, 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 no! Nope. Stream elements. Tim has dropped something two times today. Bringing him to 64 lifetime drops, folks. I think that'll do. So, that's relatively up, up and down. I think that's good. Um, okay, so you know what? I might hit it with the wire wheel. Yeah. You know what? I'm not going to worry about it. Um, let's just move on. We're going to... So, so you can see... Oh, here. Let me go to my bigger camera here. Uh, uh, big. So that's where we're at right now. So that part is going to stick down into whatever bowl thing that we make. And then, so I'm just going to cool all this down so I can just handle it. And uh, we'll put a point here and then we'll loop it up and make a little finger or handhold thing. Um, let's give her a little bath here. And keep moving forward. All right. It's always the proper way to see if things are hot. Uh, you touch them. It's always a great idea. But we're good. It wasn't hot, so. All right, we're making a thing. Thanks for hanging out in the forge. If you haven't liked already, give me a little like, follow, subscribe for all this great ugh, sexiness. Ugh. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. I mean, you can't miss out. Gonna start doing hot tub streams uh, soon. Um, the hot tubs are back ordered uh, in China because of the chips. So there's a little delay on the hot tub, but soon we're gonna do some hot tub streams. And yes, it turns into Tin the Blacksmith After Dark. And it gets real hot. Ginger underscore snap. Just get a kiddie pool. That's what a Murand does. All right. I don't actually need a an actual one. I forgot. All right. This is getting awkward to hold here. No, 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 no. No. Come here. I can't see 
because my hair is in the way. Stream elements. Tim has dropped something three times today. Bringing him to 65 lifetime drops, folks. Great. Thank you for reminding me. Okay. Thanks, Tim the Blacksmith Squire. Really you know how to keep me in track. Um, so we don't really need to get this to like a fine point. We're just going to kind of taper it down. We don't want it to be pokey when you're trying to handle it. Exactly, Opie. It's drop forged. I'll put that in the description when I go to sell it. Drop forged in the USA. Not wrong. Come here. Hang. That's good. I'll just kind of pound out the edges a little bit. So there's not any sharp corners on it. Ah! Ah! That one was hot. Ow! Ah, oh, that was a drop in an alley right there. Ow. Stream elements. Tim has dropped something four times today, bringing him to 66 lifetime drops, folks. <sighs> Stream elements. Ow. Ow. Owie. One owies today. Tim now has 18 lifetime owies. And a little warm. Okay, so. Peach wine. Only 18. I feel like you got at least a dozen of those from one day. Oh no, I definitely did. When I was resetting the counters today, I didn't have any last stream apparently. But that, like two streams ago, I was not doing good. Um, so we just kind of tapered that down a little bit. Uh, I just want to leave it kind of, and we uh, hit the edges so it's not, they're not sharp edges, they're kind of round because this is going to be in your hand. So um, if we look at it like this, so let's look at our, look at our thing here. So if we're comparing here, we got to do an up loop for like a finger hold. So... We got to put a bend here, so then it'll go straight up, and then maybe we'll wrap it around that same pole, and then that'll give us our, um, our little loop thing that we want. So let's get our pole back out. So let's heat up where that junction is going to be. Actually, we could do this all in one heat if we're good enough, but we'll see. We're not in any rush, so, but we do want to get better at getting faster. 
well, I guess I can't really do it in one heat because I'm just heating up. I'm heating up the junction to put it up to a 90 degree, and then after that, I'll probably actually put that in the water um, and cool it down so it doesn't bend when we're when we're putting the finger hole into it. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what he said, right, guys? Because it's gay. <laughs> Can't see anything. Encumbering on my vision. I'll tell you what. Um, XX Vapo or XXX. Where's that majestic headband today? I forgot it inside, so I have to deal with it. Um. Well, I'll get that heated back up and get that better shape of where we want it. I just use some scrolling tongs, we'll be all right. I think we're about where we want to be. You know, I keep losing my mouse here. So, so here's where we're at. So now, it just needs to bend here, so then it's a little holder thing. So, go this way. So, heat her up. And let's do that. Put a good sizable bend in her. Making progress. X 
XX Vapor or XXX. Next time you and the wife are in Warsaw, you should stop by Shenanigans on Friday. I cook you the best fish in town. Oh, Shenanigans! Word up. Although I used to make a pretty mean fish fry myself, so we'll see. Hey, Farber, what's that place with all the shit on the walls? Shenanigans? Oh. <laughs> um, actually, why don't we just do it over the uh, horn here? Yep, LOL, that's where it came from. Instead of using the pipe, we're just going to do it over our horn, which is perfectly fine. I didn't change my anvil for this. Sorry about that, but here we are. Um, I have thinking I should have kind of rat tailed the other side, but I can do that real quick actually. So I think this is about where I want it. So that's the, the handle bit, which I think, actually maybe I won't, I was thinking about like kind of rat tail on this side up, like kind of scrolling it, but, but actually it's not a bad place for like two fingers to hold the back of it there. Um, so I actually might call that good. Heat it up and give it a good scrape. And then we got to figure out how to make this the bottom piece to uh, make it into the candle holder instead of just a squirrely bit of metal. Which really it just has to be like a round shape and like some sides on it. So we'll see how how we're gonna figure that one out. Well this one definitely has some some character to it. I like it though. Mrs. Blacksmith, are you still on? got off to start making dinner or something because this candle that I got out here is a uh, to see if we're in the right area is kind of a decoration so I was trying to see if I could use it to, to melt some wax onto this piece but at the same time it's gonna be I mean you're gonna have a candle in it so it's gonna put wax on it and become a barrier anyways and it's not going to be like exposed to water and stuff, so I don't think it's really going to rust too much. But all right, that's pretty good. So 
there we go. We got the, the handhold there. Uh, whoa. Now we're getting a little disco action. Uh, 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 uh. All right. Let's dunk this because we're done with this piece, really. I might take the... Uh, the spinning uh, wire wheel to it to kind of clean it up. But I think it's good. Plus my blacksmith brew has a bunch of like rusty flakes that kind of gets over everything as well. Where's my rag? Rag? Rag boy! Yeah, I think once I hit it with a the wire wheel, it'll look a little better, but still kind of cool, though. Um, maybe just a vigor scratching with the old wire brush might be all right. get to my I think this turned out alright just gotta figure out the bottom but but I mean yeah it's got a, a couple get a couple fingers in there um, so like that and then we'll put a base on it here and then you can walk around and Oh, I need to light up this room. When your lights go out, you're good to go. So, uh oh, SOS, locate DJ L. <laughs> <laughs> he says, <laughs> I think that's a good size. So your candle will sit in there like that. And uh, well, I guess in theory, well, if you're holding it, it might be a little close to your finger, but I guess not. That's all right. Um, yeah, no, it's perfectly fine. So your candle will sit in there like that. So let's try and make a base for this. Peach wine. Tested for science. <laughs> All right, when we're done. Um, when we finish this, we will light this candle. And prove that it works and it won't burn you, hopefully. Peach wine. See if it adds to the OE counter or not. Exactly. <laughs> I want to say it, it won't, but we will find out. All right, so what did I do? So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this piece here and I'm just going to kind of rough mark out a circle. I'm going to cut that up. Um, we'll drift a hole in the middle of it. 
and then we'll try and fold up the sides of it and see how that looks. Um, so I need a marker. Or actually, I have my slopestone. Doesn't have to be perfect. Just has to be kind of in the ballpark of circle. Close enough. Okay. Now we're going to do some modern blacksmithing, if you will. I'm going to cut this out somehow. Um, let's get our spinning wheel, spinning wheel of death out here. Hopefully we don't get our hair caught in it. And let's cut this up. secure as I was hoping. I um, guess I could go up and down. Hold on. I always gets a little deathly over here with this thing. We don't want a major owie. Alright, let's go this way. Let's go vertical. Ugh. All right, take two. Maybe a little uh, protective gear might help here. Sparks are a little rough on the arm. Let's uh, put on our old smock here. Maybe put a glove on. Won't be a bad idea. Where's my right-handed glove? We're getting there.
Hey! It's okay, I'm a trained professional. Everything's normal, this is perfectly fine. Yeah, it's a little safer. It's fine. All right, we're getting there. I am a professional. Do not do this without proper training. <laughs> yeah, right. done. wheel a little smaller than it was when we started. Is my hair on fire? Make sure my hair's not on fire. <sighs> huh? What? Yeah, I probably could have put on some some ear protection as well, but here we are. I'm sure that was exciting for you all as well. Okay, so. That's just, that's what we're doing. It's the basic turn into a circle. PWNSS. Can't even contain my excitement. Oh, I know. You get excited pretty easily, I tell you what. So let's go ahead and drift a hole in this. Um, hopefully our force didn't die and all that. Um, 
I could just drill a hole. I don't know if I have to worry about trying to drift it. Well, actually, my drill's not hooked up, and my portable drill isn't out here, so we're going to drift a hole. So we're doing it proper. Just wet myself with excitement twice. <laughs> so excited. Couldn't even type. Yeah, I know. I know. Here for the grinding. Um, well, our forge didn't die, so that's good. Just get that heated up in the middle there. And we'll drift a hole in it. Shouldn't take too long because it's a pretty thin piece. And then um, we'll start bending up the edges to try and make some sort of bowl thing. Blacksmith ASMR! Uh, we're making a candle holder. So, so far we, uh, we made this bit. So the candle goes in there, and then we're gonna build the base for it. <laughs> That's right, we're making history. So now we're uh, we're trying to make the uh, the base of it. So step one, we're gonna drift a hole. And then we're gonna clean up the sides a bit. And then start bending it up some way. Um, let's go. Come on, mouse, swag it. Here we go. That was pretty simple. I probably kind of blew out the, the bottom there, but I kind of just went for it, which is fine, I guess. Um, yeah, so that's actually a perfect size. So I'll heat it back up and we'll uh, we'll hit it from the other side and get that the bottom cleaned up there. Or actually, you know what? That could be the top. So, Huh. That would actually work out pretty well. Um, and it does give it kind of that rustic look again. So the idea being that I'll heat up the bottom of this and peen it over. Well, it's a bit big for a peen, I guess. Um, yeah, I got more than enough material for that. Because if I don't... That's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> um, Cause I can't just really hit it flat there because then it's not gonna sit it's not gonna sit flat on a thing. But I have way more than enough than a peen. Because a peen you would just you know heat heat up the end and then just flatten it out there. 
And, uh, um, let me think about this for a second here. You ever watch Bear? Yeah, Black, Black Bear Forge is great. He's an awesome dude. Seems like the handle would be below flame as you walk. Handle would heat up. Uh, yeah, Black Bear Forge, great. Um, yeah, we're going to test the, uh, if it's going to get my fingers hot or not, but we'll see. Um, I've never made like a bowl type shape thing. And, uh, right off the bat, I'm not liking this idea. Well, A, it's like off kilter there. It's not in the center. Well, the hole's in the center, but the uh, I didn't account for the uh, this down part is not in the center here, obviously, because that's where the candle's got to go. So I should have put the hole off center. Um... Trying to think of how I want to do this. Um, I mean, maybe I could heat. Maybe I could heat all that up and I could pound it flat enough where it would sit relatively flat. Um, I guess we could try it. So, yeah, I guess I'll try that. Upset the bottom to get a little tighter. If you had enough to bend that to the middle, then down through the plate. Yeah, upset the bottom so it gets a little thicker. All right, let me try to, so I have a little hand propane forge. I'm gonna see if I can get the tip of this hot enough where then I could potentially upset it, bend it down. I don't know. I just figuring stuff out as we go. It may or may not work. We will find out soon enough. Make sure our forge doesn't go out. Lucy Goosey. Yeah. What's going on, Dirty Smith? Good to see you again. Um, yeah, I uh, never tried this idea, so I don't know. If I really planned accordingly. And uh, this thing is out of propane, apparently. 
So that's definitely not gonna work. All right, well, let's just throw it back in the forge since that's plenty hot. Heat the whole coil in your forge, invert it, quench up to where you need it hot. Um, so it's not spring steel. We actually made that circle. We made all those circly bits to make this uh, candle holder that we're trying to make. Um, now I'm just trying to figure out how to make the base and to get this to fit up right. And quench up where I need to get hot. Well, I think I can get the tip hot without getting the, the coil hot and I can pound on it all right <coughs> that's what she said <laughs> that's what she said Use that's it. what she said um Yeah, I made my hole a little too big. Um, Stream elements. Tim has dropped something five times today, bringing him to 67 lifetime drops, folks. Uh, do I have a welder? No. Do I have a ball peen? Yes. It's just I left myself way more than enough to just peen that over, you know? Like, that's way more than enough to peen it, but. Um, you know what, maybe I'll heat it up again, throw it in my vise, and maybe I can. Uh, INTRS daying idea, Tim. Uh, yeah, that's what I was just thinking too. Put it in the vise, and then get it hot and try and pound it down that way. Let's do that. Bend that tail to center of coil first. Hammer, okay. So then it's centered, right? That's what we're saying? To get the uh, the bottom piece to the center of the coil. I need that hammer anyways. Okay, so I got, I didn't change my anvil for this, sorry, but. Uh, hammer the lip you got when you drifted it. So it pulls up the hole, yeah. You could use a peen like a hand tool, set the ball in on the round bar and smack it with a hammer like a rivet. Okay, cause it gets upset. 
Stream elements. The device would need to be held. Tim has dropped okay. something six times today. All right, Bring so. to 68 lifetime drops, folks. So I, I bent that into the center there. So that's that's good. Okay. Um, so let's heat that back up and see if we can maybe pin it to the bottom of this thing. Device would be need to hold the material. Gotcha. Um, we'll figure it out. I thought I was working with two feet. <laughs> yeah, I got some, but not potentially everything I need. And but we figure it out. All right, so we got that there. That's backwards. Vice a little better. And now I spent all the time trying to get in the vice and I lost my heat. Uh, so let's reset. Uh, and also, some of the springs are not a little too hot, so it's kind of messing with my spring idea here. I'm going to cool down all these spring bits because they were kind of moving around while I was trying to mess with that. And I don't want to get those moving around anymore. Uh, uh, I got to start somewhere. Tools get built up over time as you discover what you need. Yeah. At least I have a torch set and a welder. Yeah, that's one of those things I got to... I gotta figure out how to weld. I mean, it doesn't look too difficult to at least do some basic shit, but for now, I'll just keep doing what I'm doing. And I like to try and figure it out, you know, like the old school way, the best I can, but sometimes modern, I mean, that's what they made modern tools for, to make things easier, but, you know. We'll figure it out. Nice. Yeah, I can go for a couple good jigs as well. This is not working. Um, where are my tongs? 
Where are my players? <sighs> Being frustrated. So instead of peening, it's just pounding that over. Hit her up and try it again, I guess. Oh, starting to get to the frustrating point of this project, my friends. Welding in a nutshell is heat, feed, and speed. Makes sense. Yeah, I mean, it looks, it looks relatively simple for at least tack welding stuff or whatever and I just uh, well then I don't know if I have the right because I don't think I have the enough power out here in the barn because don't you need more than uh, uh, 210 or whatever electric to run a welder don't you need a higher voltage Cause like I could easily go down and buy a welder from like Harbor Freight, but I don't know if I have the pow the right power to do it. I started out gas welding, gotcha. And enough amps. What's going on, Seagull Forge? Good to see ya. Yeah, is it more of the amps, I guess? Um like I said I haven't looked into welding. <coughs> I don't like this piece of metal. This is not doing what I want it to do at all. At least I got some calming music though, this is nice. Peach wine. Uh, Welcome at Mikey's underscore anvil. 220 with a 50 amp breaker, okay. Just on break at work, nice. Making anything cool today, Seagoat? Mikey's anvil, how are you? Welcome in, welcome in. They make 110 machines, both MIG and stick. Okay. 10 past midnight, so about to head to bed. Sounds good, Stelio. Thanks again for coming in and hanging out. Always appreciate it. Hope you enjoyed your stay. Um, so... I don't know what else I have for a base here. Because this this plate is not, I think the hole is too big and it's just not, it's not doing what I want it to do. Uh, always enjoying Tim's love show. <laughs> Thanks, Delios. Head back in myself working on stuff this weekend. Tongs, skewers, herb knife. Nice. Post on Discord. Yep, yep. I'll always keep posting my final products on Instagram. Um, if we finish this one tonight, it's uh, questionable currently because it's making me very frustrated. So... Things are not going how I want.
So I probably got the hole a little too big. And every time that I pound it here, it it bends down, but it doesn't bend down onto this plate. It just it like pushes it out of the way. Um So I don't know. Going crazy. Going crazy. Um, maybe if I try to fix up this plate a little more. I don't know. I don't know. I'm getting frustrated. Where's my beer? I mean, I've never tried to make, you know, I've never tried to make this bowl type shape, but I've never tried to peen something in like this before. So I'm kind of trying to figure out as I go. Um, well, I definitely think it would have been easier if I didn't make that hole so big. So maybe if I close up this hole a little bit, because it's kind of got some you know, because I blew it out like this. So maybe if I kind of squeeze that back in, make it a little tighter fit, uh, then maybe it'll it'll help when I try to peen it over or whatever. I don't know. Here in Tim's party barn, uh, we really don't know what we're doing. <laughs> But the beer's cold and we're learning, so it ain't all bad. Plus, uh, I'm devilishly good looking, so that always helps. a little tighter. All right, let's try this again. Um, let's see what happens. Ah. Let's see what happens. Thank you guys all for the tips though and trying to help me out in this endeavor. This may or may not work, we'll see. Jack, how are you my friend? How are you? Good to see you. Jacker underscore ST. Keep it on. What's new in Tim Land? Nice. Oh, we're trying to to make a little candle holder. And uh, the base is giving us a little issue here. Because I don't know what I'm doing, but 
trying to figure it out. Jacker underscore ST. Step one of knowing what you're doing is not knowing. That's right. Just hit it harder, right? Wrong. Kinda. It's kinda, kinda peened, kinda not peened. Again, I think I made my hole too big. Just shoved it down in there, which is not what I wanted to do. Uh, I may give up on this idea tonight, guys. Because it's very frustrating. in pain how are you welcome in so as I was pounding it it pounded it down in there because all of this was hot so it was just but I mean this is what we made so far which is the handle of a candle holder and the base is just giving us some issue so that's street elements what i'm doing thank you for following speed of live hey speed of speed of feel live thank you for that follow and close to our follow we we hit our sub goal today we actually got over our sub goal which is great I'm excited about that. Getting our follows up there. If you haven't liked a follow, give me a follow. Also hit me up on Instagram. You can see my finished projects. Um, I may or may not finish this one tonight. Um, I may have to sleep on it, rethink, see what metal I got, and, and get this base figured out. kind of unfortunate but because we hit our subscriber goal we're gonna do uh, we're gonna throw some things at the wall how about that we're gonna try and do some knife throwing today see if we can't win some people some tin bits so I'm just gonna heat this up and and get that pulled out and then rethink this this idea for this weekend. Um, I always do th Thursdays and then I'm trying to do Saturdays as well for streaming. So this may be a finish on Saturday project because stream elements. It's frustrating. Instagram.com slash Tim the Blacksmith. That's me. Thanks, Vapo. All right. Um, I think that's good enough for the time being. Stream elements. Let's hear the number 135. Vapor wants to get a little dirty again. Hollywood underscore PWNSS. Go ahead ahead of time and we will set up a prediction, LOL. Yeah. Um...
It's gonna be soon because I guess I'm done with this project for today. Um, because it's just not working how I wanted it to and I'm getting frustrated and I think I just need a different base. This is just kind of too thin. Um, and now it's at the bottom of my stew here. So, I guess for, we'll show you what we were going for and where we got to. Uh, I'll get the dirty limerick here in a second here, Vapor. Um, so this was what we were kind of going off of. Uh, this is where we got to. Um, so a little handle on it. Uh, I just having trouble with the base. I mean, on this picture, it looks like the bottom is kind of wrapped around something, but I wanted to kind of put it through the bottom and then peen it over. But I think I just, I, I got to get, a, I think I need a thicker piece of, on the bottom or something. Um, but I mean, that's the idea here. And now that that's in the middle, it's kind of holding it there. Um, So at least that was a success, coiling things up. All right, let's get a little nerdy. Space punched. Red rocket. <laughs> Space punch is here for the red rocket. He loves it. Okay, cut the music. We gotta get some dirty limericks going here. Uh, pause the music. And we got Dirty Limerick number 135. All right, we're going deep. Might be almost the last one. Oh, no, we got some pages here. 135 uh, is not actually a thing here. What is this? Do? We have to do 134. It ends at 134, and then it's a, a thing. Okay, here we go. Dirty Limerick, 134, because there is no 135, apparently. There was a young lady named Skinner who dreamt that her lover was in her. She woke with a start and let out a fart that was followed by luncheon and dinner. Hold on. She woke with a... That was followed by luncheon and dinner. Dreamt that her lover was in her. I don't think I get that one. What do you mean it? Okay, let's, let's read it again. There was a young lady named Skinner who dreamt that her lover was in her. She woke with a start and let out a fart that was followed by luncheon and dinner. Oh, does that mean she shit herself? Yeah, okay, I get it now. <laughs> she shit herself. Yeah, you like my... That's my, uh... That's my dumper cam. It's good, right? Ugh. Okay, I get it now. She shit herself. I like it. Okay. Sometimes they take me a minute. All right, we're going to call that one okay. Just because I didn't get it at first, but it's actually a good one. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to start, we're going to do, uh, actually, here we go. Ow. It bit me. Like we had this nice, that's what she said, sign that I made. And we're going to throw knives at this, at uh, Michael Scott here. And uh, so, step one, 
Let's get it bolted to the wall in some fashion. And then uh, let's see if we can get our, our knife to stick in him. Let's kill our forge. It's going to be done forging, I suppose, for now. All right. This is my nice uh, Christmas stocking that I made. Let's get some nails. Where are my nails at? It. Those are quite big, though. I don't need them quite that big. Uh, all right, let's have some fun. All right, one more just for posterity, and we have four for the funds of it. It's not going to go anywhere, but. All right, so. Oh, actually, because I said I would test it, even though we didn't finish it, let's see. Let's see if this is going to work without burning ourselves. So. Light. Hello. Step one, get a lighter that works. Give me fire. Fire, 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 fire. Come on, even my propane. Thing doesn't get a come on. I just want to test it. Ah. Uh. Um. Hello. Let's have a working lighter. For real. Great, I have a second one in this drawer that doesn't work either. What the f six people are Rick's XX. Now we witness caveman make fire. Cold. 
They probably don't have anything in them, I guess. I can't even put it in the garbage. Sugar under sports net. Hold the metal part in your hand to warm it up. Space punch. Got flint. I should learn how to, I should get some flint and tinder and figure out how to make a fire without this modern technology that sucks. It's got to blow it, right? That's what that's what it was. Way to go, Ginger Snap. You're so smart. Ginger underscore snap. Told ya. You're so smart. Oh my god, look. Look at this. Hold on. Look, we're so cute. Look. Ginger underscore snap. Stoner knowledge. Yay! You know what? I could just flatten out instead of making a base. It works. Right? See, now that I bent this into the middle, it has, it's sitting on something. So, I mean, I could, in theory, just heat this back up, make it a little flatter, and then it'll just drip on itself. Whatever. We don't need a drip catcher, right? Uh, uh. And then I turned and there was a scary man that just blew out the, the candle. Okay. Well, that was fun. Ugh. All that time to light it. Lit for two seconds and I blew it out. <sighs> All right, well, whatever. We made, we kind of made a thing today. We have made a thing. We learned some things, so that's good. All right. So, let's get to throwing some stuff here. Uh, is this coming? All right, we got the old, that's what she said on the wall. So we're gonna try and hit it. Um, what can we bet on here? So, I mean, there is the basic one, do I even get it to stick? And then we can try and aim for his face. So now we're kind of going for accuracy. How about this? Um, best three out of five that I can get it into his face. Like right in the center. So can you do Let's see, how does the betting thing work? Now. Wait. Yeah, how do you do the, uh, do some sort of bidding things or bet thing? So, will, will I successfully land three out of, three out of five? I'll do three out of five. Sex, can I can Hollywood I get three? PWNSS. Three out of five. You have to hit him in the face three times. Yes. That's what it is. Will Tim hit him three out of five times in the face? Get the stick. Three out of five times. Yes or no? Get your bets in. However that works.
And of course, we'll be throwing this non-throwing knife that we made a while back. I think what I need to do in upcoming streams is make like a ninja star, an actual throwing knife, and maybe some other things, and then you guys can choose what I throw. That would be fun. All right, the poll's up. Will Tim stick three out of five into the face of Michael Scott? Get your bets in. Got someone bidding up the 500 saying no. Bet your Tim pits. You could win some. Oh, someone's we got a few going in the yes. Some people think I they have faith in me. Uh, if I do get it, I think you you win or something. I don't know. You can get some Tim bits. I don't know if you lose them. You might lose them. You might win them. Get your bets in. Still leaning in the no direction, but that's okay. Hey, for the record, my track record is like kind of one in one. Last time was pretty good. First time was kind of not good. Hollywood underscore PWNSS. Not good. Yeah, yeah. XX Vapo RXXX. Two to ten. Is that the count? Is that the count? Okay, okay. I didn't realize you guys were actually paying attention and counting. <coughs> Get your bets in, folks. 860 for no. Is that it? Are all bets in? It went away, so I'm guessing so. Whoa! Almost died. All right. XX Vapo or XXX. Sounds about right. Okay, here we go. Throw number one of five. We're going to get it. Going for the face. All right, here we go. No! Oh, Swing and a miss. Whew. Dang. That one wasn't even really that close. Did that even like smack him somewhere? Oh, right up here. There's a divot from the back end of it. Oh, all right, come on. Twine. Distracting noise. Oh, you son of a bitch. Someone didn't have any faith in me. Come on, we can't go two misses in a row. We gotta get this here. Ah, darn it. That one was too low. And it didn't even stick down here. My rotation is off. Tell you what. Uh, yeet. All right, well. XX Vapo or XXX. Harder. Harder, faster, stronger. All right, well, I got to make all the rest of these. That's what she said. <laughs> That's what she said. Listen. Come on, Tim. Come on, Tim. Not even close, Peach Tim. Wine. Unfortunately, there weren't enough suckers voting yes to steal points from. Uh, well, I failed. 0 for 3. Can I even get 1 out of 5? I hate 170k channel points with another streamer who regularly does predictions. Hollywood underscore PWNSS. Should have really just gone one stick in five attempts, lol. Right? I was, I was apparently feeling cocky today because I got two sticks last time. Peach wine. Three was very ambitious. Uh, it was. But, you know, 
I was feeling, I was feeling it. I was feeling it. All right. Last attempt out of five. Can he even get one to stick? Oh, come on. I hit him right in the face, but it, I think the, the back end of it hit. I dented in his face pretty good. Well, thanks for playing along. <laughs> XX Vapor or XXX. How about this poll? How many will it take? Oh man, we're gonna be here all night if we do that. <laughs> XX Vapor or XXX. Put a few gooses. That will not kill. I don't know. It put a pretty good dent into his Over face. <laughs> it pretty put a pretty big dent in his face with the back end of it. I wouldn't want to get hit with that. It would at least break a nose. Over under 45. Ginger underscore snap. Plus five bludgeoning damage. Exactly. Just not on today, folks. Uh, uh. All right, rapid fire. Rapid. <laughs> rapid fire. Rapid fire. Each one. Rapid fire. Self inflicted blood and damage. Uh, rapid fire. <sighs> Might be self inflicted piercing damage by it bouncing off like that. <sighs> rapid fire. Rapid fire. Oh, that was close. Rapid fire. XX Vapor or XXX. Time to forge them throwing knives, yeah? Yeah, it is, right? Peach wine. Hey! Have you thought about being better? Rapid fire! I have thought about being better. <sighs> Thought real hard about it. Rapid fire! Rapid fire! <laughs> ah! That one bounced off Stream quite elements. a bit. Thank you for following Mets Glass Design. Mets Glass Design, thank you. Underscore PWNSS. Rapid fire. Need to forge a bunch of knives for this. Uh, yeah, I do. I need to Peach forge wine. some actual throwing do these knives. Count as drops? Rapid fire. No, these don't count as drops because I'm actively throwing it, okay? Rapid fire. <laughs> Rapid fire! Rapid fire! Just, I just want one. It's stuck in the floor. Does that count? Uh, man, I really was ambitious. Fumbly knife hands. Hollywood underscore PWNSS. No. Jeez, that's in there pretty XX good. People are XXX. Watch your toes. Man, I really was ambitious saying three out of five, wasn't I? Yikes. Yeah, I'm done with the candle holder there, Mrs. Smith. I gave up on the base. Hollywood I'll have to finish it up. WNSS. Try gripping the blade first. All right. Like this. Hey. Whoa! Jesus. Back into my face. Okay. That one scared Tim the blacksmith for a little bit. Nice glass design. Ready with a party of 29. Where's my raid thing got going on? Stream elements. Mets Glass Designs just hosted the stream for 25 years. Stream Elements. Mets Glass Designs just raided the channel with 29 viewers. XX Vapor or XXX. Welcome Raiders. Hey! Thank you Mets Glass Design, much appreciated. AMR underscore blades just subscribed. 
I could do this all day. Hail to the king, baby. Beach wine, thank you for the gifted sub out the AMR Blades. Appreciate it. Stream elements. Doing good. Hey, thank you for following Dead Nerve. Hey, Dead Nerve, Mets Glass. Mind Phantom, what's going on? Did you uh, blow some good glass today? Peach wine. New full. Which happens first, injury or success? <laughs> yeah, that's a uh, that's a good poll. So, welcome in new uh, raiders and uh, friends. So we um, we tried making a. Uh, here, let me switch my camera here. We tried making a candle holder here. Um, so we, uh, we did have a good day on the torch. No waste, made stuff, nice. Focus camera, hello, focus. Focus on me, hello. Focus, focus. Hey, there we are. Uh, so, so we we're trying to make a, a candle holder um, that was supposed to have a base on it, but um, I couldn't figure out the base properly. So I'll have to finish it another day. But we we're basing it off of this idea here, and we made this. So it's uh, it's pretty much there. I just. Uh, I got to figure out the, the base of it. I couldn't figure out the base to get it connected very good. But that's what we are doing today. Uh, oh yeah, we try to make a lot of shit too and it becomes other cool shit that's still cool. <laughs> yeah, that's what a lot of my stuff kind of turns into as well. It's like, uh, it might go into the fuck it bucket or we'll turn it into something else. Um, so... So we at least got that far, and uh, I couldn't figure out the base properly, so we have to finish up the base this weekend. Um, so that's what we were doing today. Uh, this was the base that I started working off of, but it just it wasn't doing its thing. So the idea was to, uh, to put that through there and then peen it down here. Um, so then it becomes flat and it, um, it holds itself there, but it just wasn't working out. So we'll have to finish this up another day. Um, but yeah, other than that, we, I just make just a bunch of random stuff that kind of comes to my mind or that, uh, um, that some of the, my followers want to see. Um, so here's like, here's snake a snake. I made this. Uh, a few streams ago, uh, he's a, a gear a beer guardian. Ginger underscore. So, Snick. Snick. He uh, well this beer is a little fat, but so I'll show you some of the stuff that I uh, that I've made on stream and that I kind of do here. We were just throwing a knife at a wall because I was trying to get the stick and. Uh, I did not get it to stick. Um, Bulls glass. We got another bulls. We got another glass blower. Thanks. So. Uh, XX Maple R X X X. HTTPS colon slash slash oh dot twitch dot TV slash callus sneaky don uv girl hyphen DPS RN talk hyphen JG four BLG underscore. XX Vapel RXX. What the heck is Sneaky oh, Donut Girl? XX Vapel RXXX. Uh, anyway, so, um, so yeah, kind of like, uh, just random ornamental things. So this was a snake. It kind of guards your beer. Uh, it's also a bottle opener as well. So, so snake can XX Vapel open RXXX. the beer and he can guard it for me. My name or clips weird things I don't know. Okay. Um, here's another, uh, Q 
Cupid's arrow that we made back around um, uh, February time frame for uh, Valentine's Day. Um, Got to work on my lighting here, but you can kind of see it there. So that was another fun one. Stream elements. <laughs> Thank you for following MYND fandom. Hey, Min fandom. Thank you for that. Follow. Hey, let's switch to the bigger camera. So we made this recently as well. That was fun. A little, little desk ornament, I guess. Another first thing. Um, let me see what else I can show you. Can I just do a show and tell? Because I'm starting to wind down here. I, I turned off the forge. It's starting to get a little cold, but I want to show you guys what I do here. But um, I made this uh, my first uh, bottle opener. So out of a railroad XX spike. Or XXX. Sniff. Sniff. Cool. Yeah, the Twitch clip URL names are actually kind of funny and totally random. Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. Um, I just didn't want vapor thrown in porn somehow randomly. Uh, so this is a fun bottle opener I made. Uh, you can also check out my Instagram for some of the stuff. Well, I post all my finished products on Instagram. So Tim the Blacksmith on Instagram. Uh, barn door handle. So I don't know, just a bunch of random stuff. LOL. It's supposed to show a pick with it. So there's a barn door handle that I made out of a piece of scrap. XX Vapor Same idea. XXX. So you know what it is. Yeah. I don't know. So, yeah, if you guys, uh, thank you for the extra follows and stuff. I uh, usually stream on Thursdays and Saturdays. Uh, so if you want to come in, hang out, have some fun, drink a couple beers. Watch me catch myself on fire. Uh, throw me a follow and uh, yeah. Uh, so that's another thing, just, you know, doing some twists in the metal and. All right. One last throw of the knife and then we're gonna try and f keep the raid going for, uh, for everyone else here. So, all right. Final attempt to stick it. Can he stick it? XX Vapo or XXX. How did the motorcycle helmet hold turn up? I think it turned out pretty good. I think uh, Hollywood said it fits. He's just got to put it on his wall. All right. Stick it. Oh, butt end again. Well, this was a. Uh, a knife I made as well on stream. Clearly it's not a proper throwing knife. So we gotta make one of those or a bunch of them so that I can actually get this to stick into the wall. But with that, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and try and find another streamer uh, to keep the good feelings going. Thanks again, Mets Glass, for the raid, I appreciate it. Thanks for all the new follows. We hit the subscriber goal. We uh, we're up over, we're up to 27 now, which is great. Thanks for the gifted stub there, uh, Peach Wine to AMR Blades. All the new follows, subscribes, greatly appreciate it. We're gonna go try and find uh, some of our friends here. Uh, if you have any, uh, I don't have a Discord. Thank you for following one Kai underscore Pi One. One Kai Pi One. Thank you. Um, let's go see if uh, some of our friends are online and we're gonna keep the raid going here. Uh, let's see, raid channel. Uh, let's see. We got Instagram.com slash Tim the Blacksmith. Uh, let's see, we got a couple of wood crafters. Uh, we can hit up, uh, Texas Hula is always a good time. He's a he's a wood turner. He makes really cool bowls and magic wands and stuff. Um, so let's go see what's up to him. So thanks again for the raid. Thank you guys again. We will see you uh, in the near future.
Getting ready to raid in two, one. Great screen, bro. Thank you, thank you. We'll see you next time, friends.